Well, hello my friend, my name is Attila and I need to shave before I continue this video. Sawdust everywhere! Mustard piece! Okay, much better. So where was I? Oh yeah. And this is mustard piece. So I feel like the last couple of projects I put up I wasn't really like mustard piece standard, so let's make something cool today. So now I'm going to make the tough guy scene. Yeah. I even have a spotlight for it. <coughs> By the way, the unlikely event of you haven't seen the thumbnail or you haven't been able to figure out yourself by the desperate act I'm trying to put together here that uh, we are making a can of mustard piece today. Huh? Piece of Baroque. The idea here would be to mimic the specimen as closely as possible, even the sides, and uh, just have to remember everything will be fine, otherwise you wouldn't see this video. Send it up a tiny bit, I can't even send it a lot. And uh, we cut this one off on the pencil somehow. Don't know if it's a good idea or not. But that's the plan. I'm 
going to make the body from this one. This is kind of having the same color. this wet and uh, to be honest I wouldn't mind if it had cracks in it so I might just deliberately <laughs> deliberately deliberately put it into the oven high temperature and make it crack because that would look great. That would go very well with this cracked top. There is actually nothing in it, but it looks cool. Okay, cooked it for an hour. It cracked beautifully. Now the fun part, I will power carve it using this and uh, this and this. to use this diamond bit to send it and kind of clean up just use the shape of the tool to do the job for me and just hope for the best Here is the opener, I draw it on and I just drill some hole in it, now I'm going to try to carve it 
you see, this shouldn't be that difficult. because I'm uh, all about the bass. this shape and I am going to use the big gun for the start and this could be a very regrettable decision because this thing is nasty I try to do I printed this logo on a piece of label paper so basically I took off the label so it's shiny and I'm going to use glue glue that is transparent on this piece of wood and I'm just going to put this label upside down 
so the shiny paper is not going to stick to it but hopefully the ink on the paper will I have one chance with this one So good news guys, I decided to hand paint over the print on a piece of wool that is round and full of cracks and I don't have any experience whatsoever with colors, especially not with paint and that makes me either the biggest idiot on the planet or a mad genius. I would very much prefer the last one, but let me, let's just decide at the end of this video. Mustard piece. something cool today do you still remember when we started this whole thing let's just go back to the beginning 
thing I have ever done so guys please can you do me a favor can you please share this video on your Facebook page it is really difficult to start a new YouTube channel and I only have a handful of subscribers and you can't imagine how much effort does it take to produce a video like this you might think I, I made this in one day but it's literally I haven't had a break in the last six months I work full-time and I also do pretty much full-time YouTube and uh, I don't get anything out of it can you please at least share this video on your Facebook so my channel can grow thank you so guys if you made it at the end of this video thank you for watching and as always I hope to see you on the next one